about it. Oh my God. Jesus, look at how white I look in the... Yes, you have to come over more because the <gasps> camera is way back this what? time. Are you trying to like show them this? It's, it's show and tell? Is it show and tell day? <laughs> it's show and tell. <laughs> <laughs> I happen to like Crystal Light. I like Crystal Light too. You know my favorite I do? I get the peach iced tea and the sweet tea and I mix the two of them together. Okay, do so you? Let's... See, I like the pink lemonade because I like lemons and I like the raspberry lemonade. No, and... peach and sweet tea is the tip. Really? It is all the Can you thing. mix it together? Mm -hmm. Do you put it in the big picture? Yeah, the big one. You put it in the big picture. Because with me... It sounds like there's a fucking roller coaster outside. God, I hate kids. <laughs> No. Lovely Sorry. Guys oh my God. Hey, yeah. I'm here. Ireland. Hi, Ireland. Oh, yes, hello. Oh, Ireland. I should I be talking? Should I Welcome. do it in the Irish accent then? Ha I should be doing the reading today. Be careful talking about my uncle. Oh, okay. OJ? Is OJ your uncle? Is she joking? Who knows? Is that a joke? Who knows? Hi, he gonna get talked about. <laughs> Thank you to everyone who's been tuning in on my week, my week, my my Wednesday wind down. That's so nice. I've been missing it. I really. Tamika, want to you it. owe me a call. You're supposed to call me for a reading. Um, Hi, Nurse Harvey. Hi, Miss Stephanie. <coughs> um, love to hear Tracy. Thank oh, you. Oh, Stephanie. Thank I should run her the other day too. Um. Thank you everyone who tunes in on my Wednesday wind down though and letting me do my acting gig. You know, I also realized I'm like this is actually good practice to do like monologues to the videos because it's like doing an audition tape. So Tamika says she's texting you tomorrow. Okay, text me tomorrow. Um I What's would be your YouTube free in the name evening. Sean? Oh uh I think it's just Sean Little. Sean Little on YouTube. Yeah. Simple. Oh. You know what I was thinking oh all the time. Okay, now my head's out. Well, you put it on the you put it on the you put it on the jerky box. Oh, is that what? Well, this is okay now. I you like. Put this. it on the jerky box. I know, but I like this now because they never get to see the cards with you and I. I don't like that. I want them to see. Oh my god. Oh, well, they see the cards on my Wednesday wind downs. I'm all about it. All about the cards on your Wednesday wind down. I'm so fucking tired. Oh my god. Oh, I can't believe I'm having such a hard time. I can't believe you seventy five percent, and then it just says you've got something wrong with your phone. Did you update your phone yet? Uh huh. Have you updated your phone? No. You gotta update your phone. Why? You like it? I kind of. I mean, it's just a couple of things with the text message. Like, there's one that says echo. So, like, if I send someone like, "Where are you?" I can hit the screen and it goes, "Where are you? Where are you?" Like, it sends you like all like. A... <laughs> it's fun. Yes, Chloe is OJ's daughter. Yes, I already did that reading like years. Oh, ago. they had me do Chloe to see if Chloe's pregnant, pregnant, and she's. Pregnant, pregnant. Yeah, I think Chloe's pregnant. Pregnant. Mm -hmm. We Kim still don't not. believe I mean, Kylie. Kylie. Is, Kylie, right? Yeah. And you're okay. gonna hear the news that it, you know, whatever. She's gonna fake a miscarriage or something, or, something. or she's gonna say, "I never said so it." But she hasn't stairs. confirmed it. Um, she doesn't confirm that she's pregnant. Can I fix the camera? What's wrong with the camera? Tilt it. Hey. Hey. Too. hey. Is it tilted? I don't know. I don't know. Okay, so OJ. OJ is coming out. Yeah, she's gonna fake a miscarriage. That's what I think. That's what I think. Yeah, she's not pregnant. Trust me. Um. What are we talking about, OJ? He's coming out on Sunday. Is he gay? Wait, no. Hold on. <laughs> Wait. You said he's coming out. <laughs> like. That's all you ever think of. That's what you say when you say you're coming out. Okay. I'm coming out. I want the world to no, that's the okay, game. Can for gay people. you do the gay astrologies? Would you consider doing gay astrologies? What the fuck does that mean? You create. <laughs> I don't know why you had to give me a triple blank. Were you trying to send me like a telepathic method? No, I'm like, why don't? Why can't you figure that out? It's not that hard. I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. Okay, I do astrologies, yeah. but one of my clients told me that the astrologies were biased. And I got it. She's like, they're biased. What? The love readings, because I do love readings now. They're biased. And I said, why are they biased? They're not biased. She goes, yes, they're only for straight people. No, they're not. That's insane. My love readings are, I do a love astrology now, which is different than my everyday I astrology. You stay away from that. I stay away from that. I already started it. You found out what you just opened? Your Pandora's box. You just opened it up. I love doing the love Ooh, readings. Well, it went till you don't. Until you're so sick of talking about it all the time, you just want to puke. No, 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 no. They're literally five minutes long. 
on every side. So you're being accused of biased love readings. Because I, um, I don't know how to include the gays. Do you know what I mean? I don't think that, I think that sounds so silly. I can't even believe it. But, I'm, but listen to it. It, it kind of no, is silly. No, it is super silly. But you can have a unique niche in the market for all the gays. I'm in not going to do that because world. gays are the same. It doesn't matter. But you can still have a unique. A gay Taurus and a fucking straight Taurus are the same. That's the same well, thing. Well, except that with a gay Taurus, you would say there's a guy that you're, that's in love with you, not a woman that's in love you with you. You should just say, then just pick a gender neutral term like partner. Well, no, I do do that. That's like, I mean. when I, I do is, my general reading... I don't think reading, it is biased. You could just say guy or girl. Like, you could just say Taurus. He's, this he's is missing coming. it, guys. Uh, you're, you could have a unique market I'm not going to do that. That's absolutely silly. Because you know what? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It's, God, I need to stop watching scary movies and coming over here. Um, no, because we're all the same. We are all children of stars. That's it. Nothing. The only differentials between signs... Listen. Astrological signs Devin, are genders. Are genders. I know what That's Sean it. is saying. But Sean is missing no, I'm not gonna, a really good market in no, gay astrology. I'm not going to dupe anyone into believing that. And it also like offends me because I don't want people to think that they should be... Just because you're gay doesn't make your astrological sign any different. There's only things that are different are but the masculine and feminine. It's it's the only difference are masculine and feminine energy. And that is it. Period. I respect his point of view. Thank you. <gasps> I Whatever. Just, yeah. I mean, Whatever. It's, like, it's like setting me back. It's like, it's, it's. Oh my God. You're missing a great market for the game. I'm not going to lie to them because there's no need to. No. Who said you're lying? But no one, there's no difference. I don't, like me reading a gay Taurus, that doesn't mean anything. It's literally what you should just be saying is gender neutral things. A partner is interested in you. Someone is interested in you. It doesn't have to be. So if you're reading a, if you're reading a lesbian and she wants to attract a girl. No, um, this is, this is public reading, not a person. So if the then person's if it's public, gay, then just say it's, then I know. Then it's not biased. If the just, person's literally gay, like I have great gay clients right. and I know. Yeah. So if you still do general But I'm reading, doing general, like just a say, general well, Taurus reading. Part Partners or some guy. That's how they do it. When you get when you read the astrology, when you read a daily astrology, it doesn't say man or woman. It just says someone might be interested in you. It's that's it. Energy. Well, that's it. It's it's ridiculous. Like um, you know, like I, I don't I don't want like being gay doesn't make it any different. Like we don't we all we are all children of the stars. I can't believe they're all agreeing with thank you. you. But you all know what I'm talking about. No, I think no, you. No, they Everyone, do. Look they it, know what I agree with Sean. No, thank you all you. know what I'm talking about. Because it's I'm not, talking it's about a market. A no, <laughs> there is no market for it. it there's a me. market for gay astrology. No, you're there missing isn't it. because there's no gay astrologers out there. See, I know what you're t you're saying, but Sean is right. Thank you. I understand you, Tracy. Because. Yeah, well, I don't know what to under there's nothing to understand. That's insane. Tamika, all of you. Trust me. Thank Whatever. you. Thank you. Why don't you do dog astrology? <laughs> yeah, thank See? you. See, there's a market for dog love right. too. And cat, I speak, I speak <laughs> pussy. How about that? Jesus, like good grief. Tracy wants you to be the gay astrologer. Thank you. Yeah, but Ms. I don't need to be a gay. I don't need to. That doesn't. I still don't let, understand how me doing readings. For gay people makes it any different than regular, but not regular, like non-gay people. Oh, I am so bad for even saying that word. But like we're all the same. It shouldn't. Regular, just, it doesn't change. Yeah, it doesn't change. It doesn't change anything. Like everyone's the same. The only thing that changes <sighs> is masculine and feminine. That's it. Like I'm a female Taurus. Oh yes. What S C A needs a reading, Sean? What's S C A? S C A needs a reading. What's S C A? One love. One love. Thank you. One love. Thank you. Thank you. I think there's a niche. Thank you, Desi. Jesus Christ. Yeah, you know what? That was. There's I, a business niche in this. No, there isn't because somebody's I, gonna steal it now. Oh, so well, it go right matter. ahead because I don't and I don't think any gays would go see a gay astrologer that's just like going to gay yoga. No like, one said that, but you would still be the pinnacle gay astrologer because you understand the gay world, so you would get most of the gays. Like, you're missing the business aspect of it. I, there is no business because it's the same reading. There's no difference. There's no difference. I don't know what you're talking about. Like, I just don't understand what you're even talking about. And the only niche I would get are the people who are so stupid to believe that there's, like, a difference because you're gay. Whoever accused you of being biased is, it has a stupid opinion. It doesn't make any sense. That's dumb. Dumb, dumb, dumb. You're not biased. Well, She's if I just... were gay, I would do gay astrology. So, what does that mean? 
Oh, so you're gonna go to a circuit party? Oh, I mean, you're gonna get your dick sucked in a glory hole? I mean, is that what you expect me to like give them that? And no, like, that's what's the that's, difference? That's so. That's, that's the only thing that makes it gay. That well, you. that's the only thing that would make it gay. Oh, I see you getting dick. You're gonna have a three-way in a bathroom, and you're gonna get your dick sucked at the gym. Like, that's the gay thing. That's what gay guys do. What are you talking about? Oh, see, no, I didn't. Um. No, but there's throwing my hands up. I'm just I didn't there's know nothing different. About there's that. nothing different then. If you're talking about relationships, there's nothing different in reading a gay or I was talking about like Cinderella love. Like there is a nice man. It's coming along. You're just changing a word. You change the name to partner if you want to do it generally. There's it's the same read. I mean, I do. That's the same thing with astrology. Like there's no app on my phone for gay astrology because there's no gay astrology. Doesn't make any sense. No, well, because there would be no that. difference. It's okay, all the same. Okay, they're getting bored now. Thank you so much for doing a reading on OJ. You have made me whole. I am so sad that already. someone made you put this idea in your head. Whoever said that was. Cool. No, actually, it was me. Whoever I, said I that, whoever that. accused you of being biased is ridiculous. I'm not that no, me. the person who accused your readings, your astrology readings, of being biased is ridiculous. That's ridiculous. Well, I don't think she. I understood what she said. Uh, well, meant. she's being. She's a cockamamie. That's crazy. It's no, the don't, craziest don't thing. Do that. No, no, well, I, no, 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 no. That's my client, well, and I completely understood. I don't know. So there is nothing but it's to okay. understand. Okay, it's okay, okay. okay. Before we end this conversation, what exactly are you talking? about when you say gay astrology okay what does that even mean? hold on hold on because you're I, making me nervous now and i can't stand i just don't that. understand what you're even saying my love you don't watch my love readings my love readings are literally the men and then the women of the same sign uh-huh literally okay so hold on a second no 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 don't show me this is how i've been doing my readings i pull a card for a man i pull a card for a woman uh -huh. so when i pull a card for a man i see what women are coming through for that men when I pull a card for a woman, I see what men are coming through. I understood what she said based upon the way I was pulling the reading. Okay. I was literally pulling the reading for a men to woman, women to men. Okay. I was not doing it generally, so she was right. Okay, but here's what I contend. This is my retort to that. You are picking male and female energies, period. Well, I have to fix that. I have to fix it so that it is neutral. Because to me, if I was general. watching it, I would just align myself to the female Taurus because that's but what I, I align myself to. I understood where she was. All I'm saying is I understood her. And because I understood her, I felt like it wasn't fair that I was just reading heterosexual. Well, I think you just need to change, your, I think you just need to change your vocabulary. Got it. That's no, it. got it. But you have to understand the way I pull the cards. Okay is how she made her statement and she was right based upon the way I pulled the cards. Because of your when, vocabulary, yes. Not because of my fucking vocabulary, because of the way I pulled the damn cards. I know, but... I pulled the men for the women, the women for the men, and she was right. Okay. I didn't consider, a, when I do my regular general readings, then I do open it up to everybody, but this is the first time I did love. Okay. Don't, don't fix me. I realize that I need to work on how I do the love reading because I feel like I was leaving out a whole population. Well, I think you could just make it non-gender specific. I'll period. figure it out. I think that's what you should I do. I figure it out because I use new cards. So in order to do it that way, I have to figure it out. I would say just not make it gender specific. I know. You know what I'm going to do? Because I'm going to do it my fucking way. You know what I'm going to do? If I do a male and I see a male, then I'm going to say for gays, I see a male coming through. Yeah, That's just say, what yeah, I'm yeah, Just do. add two. Just say it's up to someone. You're going to charge whatever. But I was saying that is something you could have done, but then you went into toilet it sex. I don't need to do that. You know, I don't, I don't other kinds of way, sex. I don't and I was like, it. that's not what I'm talking I don't, about. I've never looked at astrology as a gay thing. All right. It's an everyone thing. It's, a, it's an everyone thing. I know, Sean took it personally. Because but I thought, it was I'm not the, trying to take it personal. Because I'm just saying, I, it was the way I was pulling well, the cards. Yeah. And I said, this could be, because I missed the mark on how I pulled the cards. It was the first time I did love readings. Mm -hmm. And then I realized that I might have to fix it. By the way, guys, don't stress out, Tracy. I know. By the way, the next time I do the love cards, I think I'm going to do it the same Let's way. Michael's day? Because I have to figure out what's comfortable for me. So I'm going to do it the same way until I feel it. So I'll apologize, but the love readings I do in the middle of the month now. Yeah, I would just say, yeah. So for when you pull a mail, say, uh, I see someone. You no, know. I know how to do it. Okay, you just have to change your vocabulary. I know how to do it. Okay. I'm just saying... The way I did the, the new love readings, because I used different cards. I, didn't, I don't use this. It literally has maybe 12 cards in a whole deck. Uh -huh. 
also it's made up different. And so I have to figure out on the spot, I decided to do male and then female. And then through her comment, I realized, yeah, I was missing a whole population of people, which isn't right. So I'll figure it out. But for right now, I'm going to do it the way I did it the last time. And then I'll figure it out. I think you should just say, when you can pull a male card, you pull a female card. And then you want to do it that way. Just say, oh, I see either a man or a woman. You know what I mean? And that's it. That's a simple But thing. I do that already in the general reading. So I know how to do it. Okay. I have to figure out with the new cards, because the cards are communicating to me differently. So I have to figure it out with the new cards, how to talk where I'm including everyone. But I'll figure it out. Mm -hmm. It's what I do for a living. All right. Besides, I wouldn't do love readings they, anyway. They're telling us to settle this offline, and I agree. Yeah. Oh, okay. we're fine. What's no, we're not right? arguing, by the no, way. No, we're not, no. It well, frustrates well, we the argue, crap out of she me. She flips the lid down. We don't do that in public. <laughs> I would have gone across, she would have gotten some fried chicken right now just to escape me. <laughs> that no, was somebody bossing me around the door. Fault. I really appreciated what she said and how she said it. No, I got, I got it immediately. I just, love you I just think it's a ma I think that astrology is an energy thing. There is no orientation that's all like that's how i've always looked at it so there's no point for me to do that i just think it's a it's an energy thing we're masculine and feminine so if i'm gay i mean again i've read in, in in like books i'm much more of a female taurus than i am a male taurus and that's it so you just have to pick which one you identify with energy wise and then that's it so you should just do male energy and female energy that's how you should I know. do it i got you but i i understood her so. oh i'm not upset i just said uh, i just i was kind of i was just under understand i still don't really understand like it. I mean, I I'm now, a, I'm now, a heterosexual female. Now I get what she's saying, but I mean, to me... Because well, you didn't understand Yeah, because I just was like, I don't even know what you're talking about, like, you know... And like, I'm all about, like, taking a hold of a niche in the market. I saturate. I look at all the YouTube videos. All, can you come closer? Because I'm missing... I look at all the YouTube videos. I study everyone, and there's nothing there for the game. Yeah, but I get why. I get why. You. Okay. I get why. Okay, thank but you. But there is nothing there for the gays. So for all my other gay friends that do this work, you might have a, a market there. You might want to consider um, some. See, Tracy's a businesswoman, you know. I understand right. that, but I don't think that... It's okay. I got other friends that would... I'm just saying, you know out. what? From someone who is very knee-deep in the gay community, I don't see any of my gay friends wanting to go to a gay astrologer because that puts us in a, in a box that we don't belong in. See... Okay, that's not true. I have Spanish people that listen to prefer Spanish astrologer. That's because that's different. That's a different kind of magic. Santeria. That's like that's no, 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 no. It has nothing to do with Santeria. Santeria has everything to do with these are my people. So you're missing it. Yeah, but gay people. So there's a market okay, for gay, gay okay, astrology. But that's, that, no, but you're I have another about, friend, Sean. Compare, Sean, if you want to pick up that, you can't compare you great Spanish market. to being gay. No, I'm picking up identity. My, I identify with you. Yes, and identify. And people who identify as gay don't want to just go and be all like, like we don't need a gay hairstylist, and we don't need a gay astrologer, and we don't need a gay doctor, and we don't need a gay this. No, you know what? That's not true because. I need a black hairdresser. I, I would love to have a black doctor. I'm saying gay people don't think like that is what I'm telling you. Uh, you That's should. why. You're, uh, you're, you're myth, there's no market for Sean, it. don't speak for all gays, I, right? Well, I'm talking about the gays that I know. I totally agree with Sean. Thank so you. So it's back and forth. I mean, I'm just saying, I don't, I just, they don't, I, all my friends, all my gay friends. I've I'd rather go I to a whole black nail salon. I have a rainbow wide full of friends. Nobody talks like that in the gay community about like wanting gay certain things. The only thing that we do like is having gay men. We like having a gay male doctor because we feel higher gay. We, we feel more we feel more comfortable getting an anal pap smear from a hot doctor that's a guy than a woman. But that's about it. That's the only time we've ever had any gay. See, thing. gay people need someone they can connect. To. Okay, I'm over this. You don't want it. No. Sean, my other friend Sean from Facebook. I mean, I already am a gay astrologer. It. I'm gay. I'm your astrologer. Bada bing, bada boom. You don't need anything else, you know? Okay. OJ. Yeah, what about OJ? Um, don't mess up the end. That's not right. Sean is 100% right. I know. Thank you. I'm always right. Who said that? Esther. <laughs> okay. OJ's getting out on Sunday. Getting out of prison. See, mm -hmm. getting out is what you're supposed to say, not coming out. That was. Oh, is that it? Say coming said, out. Early? Oh, coming I, that's out. Was coming out. I was like, coming out. Coming out. Getting out. Getting, getting out. out. Right. There right. We right. Go. 
Um, and he says he's going to relocate to Florida. I was going to say something really bad. Which has the worst politics for black folks. Florida is the worst. Like, literally, well, their I politics see that is bad. But bad Florida is also where they have, like, mobsters and stuff, right? I don't know. It's a anymore. drug. It's a drug city, like Miami. Like Miami, or well, at least like in the movies. I'm just going from what I see in movies. Like at least like you know, the whole state. In the not the whole I state. Can't. The lower. I like, can't. Not the whole state. Look, some people are agreeing with like you. the movies. Like you know what I mean. Those, those movies always take place. Those always they got those big boats. They're always wearing white. You're, you're thinking about New York. New York has. Ah, uh -uh, I'm talking about the movies where they have the big boats. I, you know, I'm talking about Reno 911. There was a whole, there was a whole plot line about that. Look, <laughs> see, get off my state. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I just think that's like where they do shady business. Florida has like a sh like the but down there, Miami. Like they do shady business right there, down there. You know what I mean? I think there's a lot of transplants. Like, in look, I mean, I live in Los Angeles, but I know what we're the kingdom of porn and Hollywood. You know where they film all their porn? San Bernardino. Yeah. 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 Oh, that's a bit. That, and I'm talking about straight porn and then gay porn, San Diego. But California is a porn state. Big porn. It is. Trust me. You just don't know. I know. You just don't watch enough movies. They're all of the, they're very, edu they're very educational. I thought Chessworth was the porn. That would be in the valley. San Bernardino Valley. The San Bernardino Valley. That is not the. That's the San Fernando ba Valley. Oh, well, whatever. All of them. All the valleys. Because it's cheaper to rent. It's cheaper to rent out like places. Yeah. 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 All right. What are we doing? Can we please get off? Oh, wait, what are we doing with OJ? So he's going to be in well, Florida? Well, he says he's going to Florida. Um, but we don't believe him. Well, I think when you come out of jail, you have to tell them who you're going to. So I'm thinking he already has somebody to go to in Florida. Ooh, like a mister? I have no idea. Do they have the documentary yet on the kind of people who date, who date prisoners? Yeah, there are women that just date prisoners. I just don't understand that. Well, it's okay. Let's get off of that. No, I just, I just don't understand. It's okay. My point to you is, mm. Florida doesn't want him. Oh. Florida said, don't come think, here. I think, but I don't think, I don't think the United States wants him. I think we need to get out of here. think like a new country. Right. We're liberal, and I don't think L.A. wants him. Yeah. Like, we're like free and open and liberal. You know liberal. what? You know what probably love him? Trump. <laughs> Because if you know OJ what? Crooked ain't got no color. Crooked is, it's crooked does. OJ takes so much attention from Trump. Um, Tracy, he oh, his, his children, children live in Florida. Florida. Oh, OJ's he acted got up kids. in Florida before going to jail. Oh, he was in Florida before he went to Vegas and got arrested. Oh, I'm learning things. That's how much I don't care. So, let's read what's around OJ. And his release. And his release. Can I talk? Yeah, you, you can always start. Okay. He's going to get married again, guys. He's going to get married. He's going to get married. He's fully aware that he is the least liked person in America. He's fully aware that he is probably the least hated, the least liked. But um, it looks to me he needs to or probably is going to get married. Um, uh, he may not stay in Florida, though. He may not stay in Florida. It might be too much attention coming to not him, but maybe his other children who have been out of the limelight. Um, he is going to become a public figure again, I promise you. He is going to get married. I think he's going to marry a Caucasian woman again. He is broken hearted that everyone believes that he killed He's already Nicole seen Brown. someone. I think so too. No, not I think. Yes. He's seen someone I already. Think, I think you're right. And she's older. Oh, he's old. How old do you think he is? He's like. I think he's got himself a Splenda Mama. Do I know what his. You guys know what that is? Splenda, is a love. Splenda Mama? This is love. He is going to get married again. Whoever he's into is loaded. 
Yeah. Money, money, money. Loaded. She is loaded. Because he's so already invested. Somebody in said OJ is broke, but he won't oh, be he broke won't for be long. Oh, he won't be long. No, he's, 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 he's got a pen pal. He's got a pen pal, y'all, because he's not even alone as we speak. The Solos card in the reverse says he's already taken. He's off the market. He hates more than anything that the world hates him. All right? That's what he hates. Oh, yeah, um, the Crystal Magic Show, he's really depressed. So... Did he kill Nicole? Yes. Didn't we know... Did we know doesn't everyone know that? Oh, yeah. Isn't that the big common no. knowledge? Mm. Like you could look it up Do in the Webster's Dick, me? like the I think I might have to tell my my peoples. I think I have to say it out loud. Want me to say it out loud? Sure. He killed her. Oh yeah, he killed he her. He killed her. He done killed her. He done killed her. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Watch that. There, they did a movie about it. He well, but did they portray that in the movie? If it comes from me, people believe it. Oh right. Right. <laughs> it's true. Sorry. Where she's He's Oprah's done twin sister over here. We got a little mini Oprah. I'm sorry. Psychic mini Tracy. Oh, yeah. See, there's the love card. Did he have help? Yes. And you know who helped him? Who's that blonde the guy? Yeah, yeah. I'm Who's kidding. that blonde? No, no. No. <laughs> no like, you're kidding. joking. But no, the blonde guy. The blonde guy. He helped her. He helped him. The blonde guy. What, guys, uh, what's his name? You all are funny. His neighbor. Yeah. Yeah, you know the guy Hati? with the K. K? No, no, Cato. Cato. Cato helped. Allegedly. I have to say allegedly now because of Cato. I don't care about OJ, but allegedly Cato helped. Yeah, I mean. <clears throat> Cato helped. That's like the running joke that he got away with murder. Yeah. He got away with it. And Cato would have uh, vomited the information, but no one ever really charged Cato with uh, oh. assisting. I got a request um, on Wednesday to see if Tupac is still alive. Mm -hmm. That's funny. Yeah, no, because apparently someone says that like there's this other there's this other person who like channels him, like gets messages from him, like mm -hmm. he's not okay. dead. I don't care. He's okay. alive. He I did that. think. Did we do it? I think that uh, OJ called Cato to make sure that Nicole was home. I also think OJ gave Cato something to get rid of. Two bucks in Cuba. Thank you. Which I think is no, how they wound up finding the gloves. Oh. Mm hmm Because I think Cato either dropped the gloves or was <laughs> like, sense. that makes sense now, right? Mm hmm, mm -hmm. But yes, he done killed the bitch. Poor thing. I didn't mean to call her a bitch. I mean, I was just like me talking flank. <laughs> so I take that back. Because she, she nobody just just die. No one noticed until you apologized, first of all. Well, I just wanted to apologize. You know you what? No, because you know what? They, they don't, don't notice. You know who would? Back. The YouTubers. And they'll be all over that fucking thread again. And I'm like, Tan. <laughs> but you apologize. Um, I get the three of swords. So, OJ, I think a thread is coming to you. It's and really scary that we live in a world that's that easy to commit murder. It's like Princess Diana was murdered. Yes, yeah, she was. That's really sad. Marilyn Monroe was murdered. Yes, you she just was. can just be murdered like all the time. <laughs> sad. It's really sad. I think um, OJ, there's a threat coming to you, and I think the threat is not from a distance. I think the threat is going to be in your face. I think people are mad at you still, and I think whoever comes to you or comes up to you wants wants to be the one to do it. Like they want to do it, and. Like, be the hero for the Browns. So, OJ, you really, really have to be careful. Um, again, there's a love interest around you. Yeah, I mean, he's, they're dating. He's, he's in a... No, I think the person that's going to try and hurt OJ has nothing to do with the family. No one in the family is trying to hurt OJ. Um, <clears throat> it'll be some nut case out, out and about. So, OJ, you really have to protect yourself. From like assassination. Well, I it's even worse because I feel like the person like I think, I think like this is OJ, and then this is someone like that close to him, like in a supermarket or something. Mm -hmm. So he has to be careful. How we all have to be careful. Yeah, you know, I get scared just walking on the street alone. Well, no, but it's not even about that. We didn't do anything. No. I'm not worried because we are not doing anything. Mm -hmm. I'm saying OJ is hated. Yes. And whereas before, he might have been roaming around, interesting enough, because we didn't have the internet. Like Something was just different. But energetically, the fact that he's getting out now is actually making people more mad. Yeah, because it seems like it's too soon. 
Well, it is, except I that he, he didn't life. go. Didn't he get life? Didn't he get life? Take thirty-three years, but he didn't go to jail for Nicole. He went to jail because he stole his own memorabilia oh, back. Right. And then they gave him like thirty three. Oh, that's years how he got into jail because he got caught. Yeah, that's right. Because mm-hmm. he got caught off. It's like Al Capone. He got that away with murder. Jail. Oh, he right. murdered thousands of people, but went into jail for his taxes. Whatever. Could Chris Jenner be the sugar mom? No, 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 no. Chris is not stupid. She will never even have a conversation with OJ. Mm. I promise you. Um. But yeah, there is a money uh, woman around. A sugar her. mama. Uh-huh. Yes. Um, but I do have some concerns. I really have some concerns for his faith, safety, and I have some concerns for his finances. I see a big sacrifice coming from two the minute for getting something, but coming with a price. Something I like think it. OJ, if you're going to be in survival mode, I think he needs to go to an island. Mm-hmm. I think you would be happier like, yeah. out of America, uh-huh. to be honest with you. Like the, um, I was wondering if he was going to get like a Tahiti. reality he show. He should go to Tahiti. You have money, his mama, mama T and Sean, the Bermuda Triangle. No, any island. It could be any island that would just like not care the that Bermuda he's there. The Bermuda Triangle, where he never comes out. Um, love to go in there. Could he get a reality show? Mm. No, I don't think so. I don't think so, but I have to tell you, I think if you did, it what probably would save his life. Because then you'd have cameras around. Yeah, but all nobody the time. would want to watch. Uh, nobody would. I don't think a network would want to. No network would want to put him on TV. That's crazy. He doesn't have money to buy his own island. Not to buy his own island, but to go to an island. Um, let me see if he's going to get a reality show. Let me see that real quick. He is going to get married again. That's for yeah, sure. Yeah, that's for sure. You think people would watch? For sure? I don't think people would watch him on TV. I'm wondering. Oh, gosh. People love train wrecks. What kind of an America do we live in? I mean, apparently people watch Borders, and that's crazy. I don't know how anyone could possibly want to watch that. I don't know if he had a reality that. show. He might confess. I'll never confess. But he might accidentally say something. Yeah, you know how you can... Someone, if someone gets him drunk and then video records it. Oh, there you go. That's what I'm talking <laughs> okay. about. Who would want to even be around him to get him drunk? <laughs> to watch him confess. Mm-hmm. Like, then their lives would be on the line. Mm-hmm. Would he get a reality show? See? That woman shows up again. This woman shows up again. This wealthy woman, yeah. Deception. Oh, he's going to cheat on you, by the way. Uh, woman. He's going to cheat on you. <laughs> we don't even need the cards for that. <laughs> Three, two women. Um, two women. Two women. One holds the money and the other one is sexy. I think they're both white. Though. Um, could he get a reality show? Mm. I think it would be a mistake for him to get a reality show. I think um, it would be a mistake. Uh, I'm getting kind of a no. No. He's going to melt, he's gonna melt the love train. Mm-hmm. Um, he's, I think, mostly like kind of afraid too much to be on TV. Because um, he's fragile inside. <laughs> Weirdo. And I think he has his sights set on some other enterprise. The gift card shows you want something. You know, it's funny you should say that because I keep getting this karma card, which is a win-win for me. Mm-hmm. And the gatekeeper so, card shows he's going to do something he's going to want to do a long time. I feel like he's been cooking something up with this, I this agree. sugar mama. And he's going to get like an enterprise. There might... Yeah, I because I keep I got the karma card and I didn't understand it yeah. twice. Yeah, and I'm, and I'm kind of it. feeling like they might even just buy like an NFL team or something like that. as like a way of getting big bucks and getting back in the spotlight. Ew. Yeah. What NFL team would actually sell it to OJ? Like, that's a... Money talks and bullshit law. No. That's a money market. Listen, the NFL is having enough problems with take a knee and take a stand. Like, it's a nightmare right now. They don't need to add OJ to the mix. Oh, but I do know that he plans on sticking around here for a while. And I mean, you know, the US of A. 
You don't think he's gonna go to an island? No. I think he's gonna take a sweet ass time here. You know, to even say he's a falling star is a compliment. <laughs> he's a murderer. I think he's Chloe's dad. Money. I, he's just, he's gonna get a lot of mo money. Money, money, money. It's all with the gift card. No, he's gonna get it's money. It's that sugar this, mama. But also, they're gonna create Whatever this something. Whatever this enterprise is, it's mm -hmm. an enterprise. They're definitely gonna create something. But I'm wondering if they're gonna create something and people won't even know that OJ's name is attached. Oh, like it's a silent partner. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I think the only time people see him on TV is if he gets interviewed by anyone. Like The View or something. Although I don't think they would want to talk to him. I think that... Chloe and his... I don't know if Chloe... I don't see Chloe anywhere around this. I don't either. Chloe's not going I think Chloe's embarrassed. Him. I don't think she wants to... You know. Chloe is she wants to focus embarrassed. on her. She wants to focus on her own on baby. On her new baby. Mm -hmm. Oh, but... Wouldn't it be interesting to see what he would say? Because he's kind of crazy and to stay in the spotlight... He might say something crazy like, Chloe could be my daughter, which means he's going to reveal that him and Chris Jenner slept together. Uh, yeah, I don't know which, I don't, I don't know. I just see him wanting to do an enterprise, I see him getting married Did quickly. him and Chris Jenner sleep together? Right? That's a good I one. I mean, didn't we already do that? We already well, let's do it again. We already ascertained that Chloe's... The, the we offspring. did, but now I want to see if they. We didn't. We didn't. Like, let's actually see if they actually slept together. Well, how else would Chloe have gotten born? Let's just look at one thing at a time, and then we can add the I two mean, and two together. Think about it. Chloe does have kind of like the chubby cheeks of OJ. So. She totally looks like a black girl. Yeah. Doesn't she? She's a, she got that <laughs> voluptuous figure. Yeah, she looks like a black girl. We already said Kylie was a daughter, not Kylie. It was a like Chloe was a daughter. We did already say that. I know, we did. Yeah, yeah, we, had yeah we did. Yeah, Chloe, we predicted Chloe's going to have a child and a daughter. Um, yes. Okay. Yes. I'm not even going to poke. I'm like, we did, I think we did. Yes, yeah. Jenna slept with him. It would make the job. How yes. How else would they get, would he come in a cup? Yes, and just... she loved it. Uh, allegedly. No way they don't come for me later. I just add the allegedly. I wonder if he's like rough and bad. He probably is. I don't know. He's a cancer. Cancers are very gentle. Oh yeah. Mhm. Mm He's a cancer. They're crazy outside of bed, but inside of oh, bed. Oh, they're like the like they're like the top like serial killers. Cancer. <laughs> Did you know that? I didn't know. I that. think they're in the top three. I think when they did they did like a article of like who's the most likely to kill, and I think it's Scorpios are up there, and so are cancers. <laughs> I think cancers actually number the one. Size. I think cancers actually is number one. Pretty sure. I have to look it up. I, I like that when they said the Tauruses, they were said, mm, Tauruses are more likely to commit um, uh, identity theft than to kill you. I'm like, oh yeah. They love their goods. They like their rich cars. And so I'm like, totally. <laughs> They're not trying I to lose totally it to murder. I would totally steal your fucking identity and drive away in your world. You could, right? I don't need your body. I just want your identity, motherfucker. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what a sign to unpredictable. Oh. And somebody said, and Gemini. And Gemini. I could see that because of the twin inside of them. Like, you just never know where the, the, the evil twin the is going to come out. Are, yeah. Gentle murder. What's that, Stacy? That's so funny. Gentle murder. Isn't that like, you could just say, it's going to be okay. Yeah. Oh. Cancel. <laughs> it's won't, you won't feel a thing. <laughs> Somebody goes definitely Gemini. I've never I had a single problem with I, a Gemini. I can just look it up like And second. I have actually never seen the twin in a Gemini, but I, I know it exists. I, I know it exists. And my like my friends, I can see it. I've never had the experience. Like my friend Alex, when he like snapped <laughs> at me. My Mars is in Gemini, so I get along with Gemini. When my friend when my friend Alex sna snapped at me, I mean he was we were just talking about it recently. He's like he was apologizing. Like, I, know, I know Desi. Let's see. Zodiac top. Seriously. Geminis get a bad rap. I mean, I've never had a bad experience with a Gemini. Mm -hmm. Seriously. On Zodiac. Kanye's a Gemini? Well, Kanye has psych problems, I though. Know that. So I don't know if that's all Gemini. That also could be his level of crazy. Uh, wait, I stopped saying crazy. His level of loop -ness. Well, here's the thing, Desi. Trump is a Gemini... With the Leo moon, it is his Leo oh, moon yeah. that makes him a narcissist. Trump actually has a good heart, but that Gemini mixed with the Leo moon makes him crazy and 
with the Leo moon, when all the attention is not on him, that's when he goes crazy. But remember, he also has a mental problem. Yes. Mm -hmm. I mean, he needs, like, tilt. But he has a Leo moon. Did you know that? That's what Kanye? makes him... No, Trump. Oh, Trump. It's a Gemini with a Leo moon. That's uh, a horrible combination. He's a Gemini? Mm hmm And a Leo. And a Leo. That's a horrible combination. No wonder he's always like that. Um, he's always what? Just so spazzy and... Awesome. Yes! Yes! Um, I'm married to a Gemini. Two out of three kids are Geminis. They're all great. <laughs> I think Trump is also a product of whomever his father was. He seems like a spitting image of that era of a man. Yeah. I am definitely not crazy. Uh-oh. Usually when people say that, I'm crazy. <clears throat> you're a Gemini with the Leo moon? Oh. oh. Well, you're a woman, so... <gasps> no, don't say that. Listen, you might want to understand that sometimes when you get out of control, it's your Leo moon not being compatible with your Gemini. Are there Gemini. times when you just blow your top? Gemini is my moon sign. Are there times when you just blow your top? Gemini is your moon? I think so, which would explain why like, I get like, when this is to explain why tornado Brenda Walsh comes out of room once in a while. <laughs> Leos can be crazy, and you you mix it with Gemini's crazy. You got Trump. Oh, Leos and Virgo, yeah, that's a good mix. Earth and fire. Oh, there's been something wrong with my sword blades. How do you know what your moon is? Google um, it. Tracy's a Leo too. You can I am Google a Leo. it. They have massive Thank stuff you, like that all over. You can just Google it. Astro Lab or something like that, and you put you, it. You in can the... just type it in Google, and then like, what's my birth sign? Like my birth birthday, and they have all sorts of places. It's free. I'm nothing like Trump. I hope not, because your title does say executive diva. Oh, how funny. <laughs> I hope not. <laughs> but um, you have to remember, Trump has a psychological issue, too. Yeah, he's like full on Either he killed one of his brothers or some dog or something. Trump did. I also think, I mean, he, if you, here's the thing. He's Isn't definitely, Trump, I mean, people. About his brother. If you see his tweets, they're always like late at night in the morning. Like, they're always so late at night. He's probably got an Adderall addiction or some kind of an upper. Yes. And if you do that much of an, if your Adderall makes you crazy because you don't sleep that much. So then if you stop to sleep, you get dementia. No, and he then... has, it's again, I don't know if it's the Gemini and the Leo, but like Kanye, there's a psychological disorder. Yeah. There's a psychological disorder, the astrology signs don't matter. Yeah. Like the, the 13th astrology sign is psychological disorder. Yeah, and disorder. if you have an addiction to a drug, well, astrology goes out the window. I'm sorry. Like every time he goes to uh, Florida, I think he is getting pumped with drugs. Uh, probably. I mean, that way nobody at the White House sees yeah, exactly. I mean, That's seriously. why he goes so much away. He has the money away. to keep it secret. And he can get like top premium Adderall. He doesn't even need to get like cocaine and stuff. Like he could just do Adderall. But I think that he, they don't even come to the White House because then it would be obvious. No. I think that's why he goes to Florida. Yeah. Um... Yeah, but I mean, but when you're doing drugs, astrology goes out the window. I'm sorry, if you're a meth head, Guess what? All so meth it doesn't matter. Act all, all my the Gemini's all meth heads with the Leo the moon because you're probably heads. fine. You, you have to have a psychological disorder to be anything like Trump and yeah, anything like Kanye. But if you up. notice, they're identical in terms of their level of crazy. And they liked each other for a minute. They and they liked each other, right? They for adored each other. I know. Well, I think Kanye probably still likes him, but I he's think he does too. but he's under meds, so he doesn't know who to like anymore because mm -hmm. he's just like he's not okay right yeah. now. Yeah, and they don't even have him on good meds. Like they should get them on. They should put them on Britney Spears meds because she's got good meds. <gasps> oh, you have a Leo moon. Well, I mean. Leo guys come on I, I love Leo's I think you just have to watch the Leo moon inside of you it's a lot Leo's by themselves are a lot so imagine a Leo moon coupled with your Capricorn coupled Ooh, with your Gemini you have to own the fact that Leo inside of you is a lot I'm mean, hello look at Madonna she's the quintessential Leo oh Look at McDonough. Uh, McDonough. Oh my god, that'd be a good. I wonder what that burger would even taste like. McDonough. All would be made of tofu. It would have to have like a cross on it, though. It would be a McDonough. McDonough. Because she's like the. Or a Kabbalah bracelet in the Happy oh, Meal. Kabbalah bracelet. <laughs> yeah. And it would probably be like faux. Leos do rock. Don't sleep. I love Leos. Yeah, but look. Taurus is the best sign for the zodiac. Beyonce's a Leo rising. Oh, that makes sense. That totally 
totally makes sense. It's so narcissistic. Of course it is. <laughs> Oh, oh Jennifer she's... Lopez, classic Leo. Oh yeah, all those oh, no. divas. Jennifer, Jennifer is a tell sun sign is Leo. Oh, I always know oh, that. Oh, I mean, like, she's a fucking me, attention, short skirt, body, me. I'm sorry, did walking everybody in, look at me? Walking in and firing people. Like when she had a restaurant, she would just walk in and be like, you know what, you, you're fired. She it's, used to do she that. Used to do that all the time. I like the way she walks in because she owns it. She's like, boom, put the put the. Yeah, or how about the fact that she got in trouble though because they were having we had the water drought and she had to like they find her for like. I remember that in California. I remember that. Yeah. Um. How do you know you are? Look it up. I love Leos. Thank you, you Executive What's Diana Ross? I love Leo? Gemini's, by the way. Probably. I think Diana Ross is a Leo. I think so, Desi. I'm not sure. Leo's a sign of sun. Leo women is all warmth and fire and passion and courage. Leo men are bossy, arrogant. Look at me. I'm in charge, loyal, and they loyal, yell a lot. Leo loyal. men if love to in, yell. If you get into a Leo's pack, you're there forever, like Neil. If you get into a Leo's pocket, pack, pack. pack. Oh yeah, that's the one thing about they a Leo. Are like you're very, a friend very loyal. for life. Mm -hmm. What loyal? Yeah. You, you guys don't even understand loyal until you have a Leo friend. Or Leo Torres, are fucking we be very loyal. loyal. I'm so loyal. Well, well, until you, until you show a Leo that. If oh, you unless you Leo, cross my line. Yeah. Then it's. I don't do the whole breakup, over. makeup, breakup, makeup shit. Me no, you neither. cross that line, you get the fuck out and stay out. You, mm. Me neither. I don't make a big announcement. I know what I'm worth, though. So if you ain't worth it, get out. I don't, you don't make. See, mm -mm. I don't make a big announcement. I just kind of. Because we're cave people, too, so don't get us wrong. When we go into our cave and we start thinking. When we come out of our cave, we're going to make some decisions that are not going to be oh, nice I think to I think everyone. Announce, I'm like, do not fucking call me again. I block, I block, don't. block, and go, bye, bye, bye. I don't. Bye, bye, bye. I don't. I don't like to have arguments. I love it. Okay. It's really funny because I, looks like I argue a lot on YouTube, but actually, <laughs> but I don't argue. Okay. Sean, I never argue. Uh, sure. People come for when me. When you are sitting here with People your, when you're sitting here me. with your son, it is just a constant dialogue. <laughs> That's not arguing. People. <laughs> yes, it is. That's love. People Crazy. come if, if you come for me. You're gonna nail you to the fucking cross. I have to. What, don't think I'm not like I'm not that girl. If you come for me, you better be prepared. Uh -huh. You too. Oh yeah. If you come for me, you better stay a while because I'm gonna serve it to you back, and you're going kill yourself <laughs> it's a tourist thing i cut people off way too quick listen to caesar who is caesar how do you even say it ja i don't know i how have you strong say that. discussion tracy you need no instigating aquarius are you doing classes are you doing classes when are we going to go back to your church is this how it's going to be forever well i love yeah maybe <sighs> relax the church is so much more convenient this is but it's okay caesar it's not the end of the world. None of this is the end of the world. No, the end of the world's already here. I mean, well, it should have happened on Saturday. What? Yeah, we were supposed to end on Saturday. What do you mean? What do you mean supposed to end on Saturday? Yeah, Saturday was the end of the world. <laughs> I keep on getting that one wrong. Yeah, me too. I didn't even know about it. I was like, I was supposed to... Did you feel that earthquake, though? I felt it. My I bed shook. It. I thought it was like a demon. I felt it. I do love watching. Thank you, guys. Oh, thank you. We love being watched. <laughs> Look at Jazz trying to get all the cancers to talk now. Jazz, my husband was scared of the earthquake. Really? I only thought that for a second. I, like, it literally, I thought I had hallucinated it. I, I see you, Desi. I don't know what SZA is. But, okay, SZA, SZA, SZA. You know who they are? I don't know. She wants me to check her out. I'm going to at you on Twitter, Sean. You are missing out. SZA is great. I do love new. Is it pop music? Because I'm not into like hip hop. It's probably Asian pop. I don't think so. I love you guys. Need to talk to you, Tracy. Psychic Tracy Brown at yahoo.com. Email me. Oh, yeah. And I'm SeanLittle14 at gmail.com. Okay. Before we go, while we were talking. It's not Libra season, is it? Oh, it is. Yeah, Libra. Oh, it's, oh, Libra, yeah, Libra, it's Libra season. season. Yeah, my son had a birthday. Oh, Tyler's Can birthday. Can I get some hearts? I see green and peach. So thank you. The world ending was moved to next month. Okay. Oh. Okay. Sure. You know where the world is ending? Puerto Rico. The world is ending in Puerto Rico. People are suffering in Puerto Rico. And by the way, everyone forgot the Virgin Islands. They got hit by Maria too, guys. God. 
as you all go to sleep tonight in your wonderful, you know, beds and blankets, you know, these countries are suffering. Like, seriously, they're not going to recover well. The mayor said in no, Puerto Rico, they're F dying. That's not how you spell my name. It's S-E-A-N, like Fien. Oh, thank you, Executive Dia. S-E-A-N, yeah, little, 14. Yeah, Sean, there you go. Yeah, Devin Deep. Oh, you got hit by Irma? Oh, I'm sorry, honey. Don't forget. Don't forget Puerto Rico. But uh, by the way, you can't donate anything to Puerto Rico because there's something about this Jones Act and shipping wasn't coming off the, the, the boats. It's just there we crazy go. what's going on. I mean, really, though, it is kind of like the world is coming to an end, though. Well, I mean, for some people, it is. I mean, just, I mean, our ozone layer, too. The whole Caribbean is gone. Every island I and, went to is not and standing. And everyone's thinking we're going to get like a big earthquake because like everyone just keeps saying it. And I wish we would stop saying that because they're just only going to make it happen. If you just stop saying it, it's not going to happen. They're just putting the energy out. <laughs> we're just like, we're going to get a big earthquake. I'm like, we are now if you keep on talking about it. How about we use our minds to not make the ground open up? I think we have to pray. What do you think? It's about I'm going to just not God. talk about it. Is what I'm not going to do. I'm not going to think about it. I'm not going to talk about it because I don't want it to happen. Well, what about Drew Barrymore? No, please God, listen to Drew Barrymore. She's not in the limelight. We never do anyone unless they're already in the limelight. They have to have a story out there, particularly by TMZ. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Thank you for the hearts. Look at I the know. hearts. It's like Thank a heart you so much. We love you. Don't go see the movie Flatliners. If you're into scary movies, it was so not worth it. Cardi B. Oh, they were asking for that last week. I know, and I haven't done it. And then she wound up being the number one something, something, something. And so I missed the boat on that. I, what do everyone, we want to do about her? To see if she's going to blow up? Is she blowing up? Well, I, I think we should do... Oh, yeah. Have her, is she going to outdo... All right, rest in peace. Rest in peace. If she's going to outdo... You know... You know, now that he's dead, I want to know if he's gay. I, also, I think he's done I everything. Think, I think he's gay. I think he's I done everything. He's, I think he's gay. Why I know that he to... changed the, the face of the way women looked, by the way, but he is not one of my favorites. No. He exposed women to in a way where they actually couldn't come back from it. And it's because of him there is so much nakedness in the world. Now, is that okay? Yeah, him at this and stage of the game, him and Madonna, I agree. <laughs> but at this stage of the game, there's, you know, we can't go back home again. You know what I mean? Like, there's too much exposure that covering up is going to be abnormal. <laughs> no. I seriously, no, I, yeah, I, know. I think his magazine did did women an injustice. Yeah. Sorry, he exploited women. Sorry, this is what Didn't I you believe. Ever have a Cosby thing? I don't know. Yes. Yes, there is something that went down at Playboy. the mansion. By the way, I think Does he have offspring? Who gets the mansion children. now? Did he give it to the he bunny? Has children. Oh. I think Hugh Hefner has been dead. Oh, you think this is a late release? Yes, I think he's been dead and they had to clean up his It feels like it. Affairs. It doesn't feel like it just happened. Right. It feels like it's a, oh. Oh. Two months, Where two is months he? old news. Yeah. Right. I think feel, he's it, doesn't, been dead. it doesn't feel like it's a. I think he died. It's not like a, and then they said he died in the Playboy Mansion. But I have to tell you, he wasn't in the Playboy Mansion. There's one of those real estate shows that brought someone to the Playboy Mansion like to, last year. to purchase it. And the Playboy Mansion was empty. He did not die in the Playboy no, Mansion. Nobody it's tells him he died of old he's age. Been, no, he's 91. Yeah, he's, he's been dead. Yeah, he's That's been the difference. Dead, I'm not saying dead. he was murdered. No, he's he wasn't been murdered. dead. He died of old and age. By the way, he's been dead for like four months. Yeah, it's like it feels like it's like a, it's like it's old, like it's the old news. I'm like, isn't he already? I mean, when I read it, I'm like, hasn't he already? But didn't he already That's die? That's what I said too. And then it dawned on me. He's been dead. Yes, because the last time I saw him, he was the crypt keeper. He was at, he's been at Doors' death for a long time. Motherfucker was 91 and lived a Playboy life, for Christ's sake. Yeah. Will his wife get anything? Um, oh, who cares? I think it's who cares? She's 30 the... something years old. Guess what she can do? Reinvent herself. I'm really, no pity. Look, look, look. No pity for the wife that may not get anything. I don't care. I know one thing, if I wound up with someone like Hugh Hefner, he wouldn't die without me making sure I had something yeah, on I the would, table. I would take his hand and force it if I had to. I would take his hand and be like, you were giving me my money. I'll take your cop's finger. I did not suck your 91-year-old dick just to get nothing. Mm. 
Oh. <laughs> the Crypt Keeper, no fish. You're going to give me something. Mm -mm. It wouldn't have been me. So, by the way, violins, if she didn't know how to get something from him, she's just a too dumb, bad. Dumb, dumb. Right. Right. I don't have sympathy. Sorry. <laughs> oh, I love you. Thank you. Oh, because uh, Stacy, because they wanted to clean up his affairs. Uh huh. He had major stuff. I think they there. also probably wanted to make sure that before they announced it, that, that there was no like scandal that would come out from it. Yeah. Like dirty business kind of scandal. Yeah. Like molested girls kind of stuff. Which that is would out ruin there. the empire. Which is how Bill Cosby might have gotten That's tied what I think in. That's it is. Like they had to keep it quite in these background checks. Like, let's make sure I we know that it's a clean. I think it's also better that he's dead because now all that all those stories yeah. are kind of hidden for a while but hey folks out there the ones that celebrate the, at the Play, Playboy Mansion that's the time to tell okay, your story you. you know things happen in that Playboy Mansion some horrible things happen in that Playboy Mansion this was not a safe place for girls send it to me and then I'll write a screenplay <laughs> that's the next biopic <laughs> lifetime mm-hmm Will Bill Cosby go to jail? Thank you. Yes. But but the article said that he died in the Playboy Mansion. They lied. And when I saw that, I was like, damn it, they're lying. He definitely died. He, oh, you know what? Maybe he did die in the Playboy Mansion. That's why it wound up being empty. Maybe he did die in the Playboy Mansion. He didn't die yesterday. Mm-hmm. No, he did not die yesterday. No. It was like, I was like, wait, isn't this old news? Isn't he dead? Yeah, see? Wow. See? Somebody's going to tell it. Somebody knows. Done Hugh Hefner. I can't do Hefner. You actually look like him with the hat on right now. Oh, shut up. Oh, not. you look like a young version of Hugh Hefner. I do not look like a young version of Hugh Hefner. Most people think I look like a young version of Keanu Reeves. Oh, I can see that. When I have my long I hair, that's all people. That's what everyone I love say. Keanu Reeves. When they had my hair. Hi, Mrs. Mommy. Like How Weekend are at Bernie's. You? Yeah. Yes! Know about Bill Cosby He's ever. been dead like Weekend at Bernie's. Yeah. Yes! Yeah. <laughs> No, I'm not going to do Bill Cosby. I hate him. And Prince. Oh, my God. Prince is such Prince. a cop. Well, they just want a spiritual reading from, from Prince. But such a complicated man. I wonder what he would tell me. Like, how would he come through? And what would he <laughs> actually he's tell me? Come through, I'm sure he's too busy up there. Too Playing music. Playing, Playing music for fun. God. Playing that guitar. Or sleeping in a velvet bed with a bunch of I wonder if he got through the pearly gates or if he's off at the corner in a special musician's... <laughs> The VIP table? Yeah, well, I, you know, God says there are different mansions for everyone, so I think he might be in a music mansion. Mansions. We all end up in different mansions? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, he's laughing. Come on, spiritual people. God said there's a different mansion for everyone. Not everyone winds up in the same place. Uh, I, you and I could die together, and they would separate us because it's different mansions. I'd go to the gay one. I don't think it works like that. Oh, it does that? Oh, labels fly out the window. <laughs> Get your wings and the labels go away. Yes. Are you? Are we all the same color? There's no color. We're all just gray. Are we all just gray color? <laughs> no. So nobody can say anything. There's We're all no, just equal. All just there's little no hints of gray. gay in heaven. We're all just God gray. would not separate you like there that. There is gay in heaven because God is gay himself. But that's not the point. God is gay because he made gay people, so I get that. Not like, just that. You are born in the made, image of him. Also made when you die, if you don't have separation up there. Like, the gays over there, not going to happen. You just said we all live in separate mansions. Based did upon... This, did, you, did you get this dialed in from Jesus? Did you have a late night phone call from him? <laughs> so, Jesus, you know what? Like, it's... what is it like up there? I miss you. Oh, you're in a mansion? Oh, what mansion? Oh, where's the Oh, she's in another mansion? Oh, so you guys live in mansions? Like, mansion mansion? Listen to me. The different mansions are for how you did in life. Oh. So, somebody that's a murderer... That and, would I, go to hell? and I cannot go to the same place. I've heard a murderer would go to hell. Isn't well, he would hell? go to hell. Okay, let's do something else. <laughs> What's another good one? I would love to party in heaven with a murderer. <laughs> oh, my God. What's another good one? Um, I can't believe it. <laughs> okay, someone, someone that robs a bank. Doesn't they go to hell, too? 
Well, that's not necessarily hell. Oh, no, wait, hell, if we're the Catholic, a oh, a murderer would go to heaven because he has to just say, I'm sorry. No, no, no. Okay, listen to me. No, that doesn't work like that. That's the Catholic way. Well, let's leave the specifics out of it. I'm just talking about the big picture of heaven. Okay. So let's say somebody robs a bank and then from, like, let's say he robs a bank, but he gives it to the world. He would wind up in heaven with me. But living in a different mansion because he stole <laughs> No. Are the are the mansions broken down by the by the sins that you can't commit the seven yes. sins? Yes. Well, it it's no by the degree of the of the sins. The no. degree. Do you understand? So, I don't care. I'm gonna but go if back somebody to... robs a bank and selfishly they like, hold on to it, either they would go to hell. Money. Well, no, that's not necessarily a hell Wouldn't act. Saint Gabriel send them to hell. But that's not a hell act. Robbing a bank is not a hell. I guess act. you're gonna take Saint Gabriel's job when you get up there, huh? You're like, you know what? You're letting all these people. I got it. I got it. Let me let me move along. I know where to put these people. I know exactly where you're gonna go. It's oh, that's not hell. Oh, you're so cute. It's you are really cute. Do that. You did what? Oh, my God, I'll forgive you. Them. Look at that cute face you made. You're so oh, cute. God. Heaven. Oh, Heaven. you. Oh, you. <laughs> It's got halitosis, God. Mm. Hell with you. I would never say anything. But there's no halitosis like, in heaven, right? <laughs> if somebody robs a bank and was like a miser and miserable and, you know, sneaky and did mean things, then he would still go to a mansion. But like a not small mansion. the same one as me. And a mansion with no windows. Do you understand? Yeah. And what mansion do you go to? And you see, I keep elevating what my mansion. You, and you were saying that, and you even did that with me and you, you're like, so if you and I died together, you would go to this mansion and I'd go to this one. So I li I get ground zero. I, I didn't know I did that. Yeah, you're like, so you and I, we, if we died, I would go to a mansion and you'd go to a mansion. There. There. Because I'm already up But not there. a gay mansion. There's no gays. There's no There's gays. No gays. There's no gays in heaven. I don't think so. I think I think all the archangels are pretty much, they're the little mean Heathers. I think they might be transgenders. The archangels. They could also just be, they could just be non, they could be both. They could be hermaphrodites. Or hermaphrodites. They both. Yeah. There's something in the Bible where these, I forget, there were, I don't know, these winged creatures came down in heaven. I don't know. You know, for somebody who quotes God so much, I think you need to go brush up on your material. <laughs> Sounds like you're just kind of like spitballing. No. Like, I think and I remember then, this from catechism a long time ago. And then they came down and they mixed with the humans. You and know they what I don't see here babies. from Miss Jesus? And God I don't had see to a kill Bible everybody. anywhere in this house. The most people who are super devout, you see Bibles. I don't see a Bible anywhere here. Oh, wait. Is it holding up your table? We have Bibles. Holding up that table. That's why the table's even, right? Oh, I have. This is how you use your Bible. <laughs> Bibles, because there's no genders are, in heaven. But Bibles are intimidating, so I'm not a fan of showing the Bible. I'm a fan of showing the cross. That's much better, because that would keep vampires out of your house. Crosses? Yeah. Did you ever watch a vampire show? Oh, is it because vampires are all white? Is that why? Because they're no. pale and white. No. But you know, in true blood, they have I don't vampires. believe in vampires anyway. Her Bible is on, on her phone. phone. Okay. <laughs> Do you have a Bible on your phone? That takes up a lot of memory. I have a um, Gateway Bible on my phone. They, you can, um, they will speak the Well, anyway, the song apparently to she's going to be St. Gabriel. She's taking St. Gabriel's job. She wants it. She knows. I think it's St. Peter's job. St. Peter, that's what it is. St. Peter. Did you ever watch those, um, the, you should watch those skits where the Disney villains try to get into heaven and St. Peter goes, no, I'm sorry, Cruella de Vil. You can't come in. Like, I know, you you I'm killed sorry. her. Oh my God, they're really funny. <laughs> Yeah, send it to me. Them all to you. They're hilarious. Because I, I would throw a temper tantrum if I didn't get it. Oh, no. Like, Cruella's like, like, oh, come on. Yes, I did. But, I mean, it's fine. You know what? I want to create a bow for I want to create a line. A line. So, just, let, me let me just write you a check. I don't need your money. Oh, come on. Just say you're in price. Just say you're in price. That's your price. Yeah, Ursula gives him a hand job with her tentacle. And she's like, you with this little thing. You don't want to come out and play. And it's like, you create it. But it's like, yes. He's like, but I do good things too. And he's like, what? She's like, you know, I'm wailing. And he's like, yeah, that was me. And it's like, that was bad. She's like, oh. Yeah, R, R. Kelly's going to hell. Said it. OJ, hell. Who else? Trump? Hell. hell. <laughs> Who else? Or reincarnated to be a squirrel. I mean, a no, to a roach. Yeah. That gets stepped. Well, no, actually, he wouldn't get reincarnated as a roach that would get stepped on. He would get reincarnated as a dog that nobody loves. Do you know how you see those mangled dogs sometimes? 
roaming the streets. You mean the ones that are homeless dogs? The yeah. Homeless dogs? Oh, but yeah, some of the homeless dogs, I feel sorry for them. I do too. And then I'm also scared of them because I'm like, they don't have any shots. <laughs> they don't, have, they any don't shots. have any shots. Don't come, don't get that dog near me. Do you know one day I was living in a valley and I would pass this woman every day with her dogs and I could hear the dog say, help me. I could hear it. I just thought, you know, homeless people. Wait, wait. One day I telepathically talked to the dogs. I stopped to talk to her. Yes, the fuck out I did. This is a true story. This is a true story. Oh. I stopped to talk to the homeless woman so that I could telepathically talk to the dogs. Stop it. Stop it true right story. now. True story. True story. Uh. And I said to the dogs, I said, you have permission to leave. They didn't know it. And then did the dog just walk away? The next time I saw the homeless woman, I said to her, where are the dogs? Well, tell me, Mrs. And she Doolittle. said, wait, wait. And she said, they just ran away. And I was like, oh, 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 it worked. I can whisper to the dogs now. The dog whisperer. Well, Mrs. I Doolittle. got the gift. Yeah, well, talking about an untapped market, I guess you got it right here. I got the she gift. got the gift to talk to pets. <laughs> They're dying. <laughs> They're dying. I, I like people more vocal. When Merlin comes up and looks at my, uh-uh, not right now. You know, just saunter on back down to the table. I'm like, I ain't got well, no time for understand. you. Well, they understand. Well, Merlin definitely does. Fucking dog whisperer right here, y'all. Well, how do you get this one? He don't move. Tell him telepathically to get out of my way. <sighs> I don't know what to do with my doggy. He's actually going through something. Uh, it is so funny. And you know what? The homeless people, it's like, this one bitch, right? She asked me for a dollar, right? She asked me for some money. And I'm like, no. And then so I was eating some bugles. I didn't want to finish them. It's like, well, you know what? I was about to toss these. The doctor goes, oh, no, thanks. <laughs> I'm like, hey, there's can't be choosers. I think that's insulting. What? I think it's insulting to take what you're eating and then say to them. You have no problem asking me for money, but I mean. Well, It was also I a think, bag of chips. It wasn't like I was giving her a half-eaten burger. I think it's insulting. I'm just like, kidding. you're devaluing She just the asked fact. me for money. I didn't have money, I think, so I gave her the loan. Yeah. I think you did it from your heart. Yeah, but well, for, I'm not going to okay. waste, waste the food. For, so for she told me to feed it to the birds, so I did. For people out there, when the homeless ask you for money. Yes, they are. Don't give them your leftovers. It's rude. It's mean. It's rude. It's inconsiderate. Like, treat them like they're human beings. Well, I did, and she gave me a response saying, oh, no, I can't mess up my teeth. I'm like, <laughs> okay, you can live on this. Well, but they, some of them have the worst teeth, so if they eat chips, it does get caught, and then who, what dentist can they go to? I just get it. I get it. When I when I get asked for money, I offer to buy them food. Okay, you can buy them food. That totally get that. Just don't give them. Well, your, she just asked me for money. I wasn't gonna. Dinner, I, it wasn't a true. leftover dinner. It was that's a bag of chips. Spill, your spittle. It's a bag of chips. It's disgusting. It's a half bag eaten bag of chips. But I but her tooth was bothering. Like she would say, I get that because they usually don't have good she dental hygiene. But they usually don't have good dental hygiene. Um. Um, yes, mermaids are real, whoever asked that question they are. I offered a homeless person my leftovers, he took it, and I was pissed. <laughs> Somebody just said that, that's really Well, funny. I'm gonna actually, I'm gonna go back to my policy of not talking to them, because you know what happened, did you, did you see that thing that went viral? Oh, it's no. like double dipping, right. Somebody, some homeless person had a concealed axe on him, like a, like a mallet, and someone offered to pay for his, like, thing, and he chased that man outside and beat him, like, and beat him with it. They arrested him, thank God. I think but, I saw that on the news. I know it's what 7-Eleven is. It's one by the Los Tacos. That, the, that must be those Flacca people. Flacca? Flacca. No, no, no. You, I mean, maybe. I don't know. But it's thank like, you. Just buy them a fresh bag of chips that your hands haven't been in. Exactly. I was, gonna, I was just, I didn't want to waste them I was respect. just, I didn't want to waste food. That's all. Treat them with respect. I did. I said, and she said, oh, give it to the birds. I'm like, fine. So I tossed it to the birds because they're going to just throw it away. Because I can't eat What if she was an stuff. angel? What if you missed... She An wasn't. angel. She wasn't. God always comes disguised. That meth pipe that she was smoking wasn't very angelic. You're lying. You did not see her with a meth pipe. I was watching her. I had nothing to do but to watch the laundry. She was You're sitting there. Lying. She was. <laughs> I swear to God. Don't listen to it. I mean, you know what? The one time I did get someone a dollar, they said, hey. I need a dollar to buy some don't drugs. I'm like, okay, here you go. At least you're fucking honest. Thank you. He said, I, I gave him a dollar for honesty. I'm like, you know, for, for that honest answer, there you go. I need drugs. Uh -huh. Give me a dollar. Like, hey, can you give me a dollar? I want, I need, I need drugs. There you go. Jesus breaks bread. Yeah, he does, but the bread is usually clean and not eaten already. It was a bag of chips. <laughs> 
You make it sound like it was like, I went, you want me to have my sandwich? Like, <laughs> well, people do that. That's why I'm telling everyone. Okay, and also, don't do okay, that. I think it's really hilarious that you're saying, like, germaphobic. A bitch is living in filth, her own filth. She doesn't even shower. Sean is the Grinch who stole Christmas. And Listen, this. that's not the point. The point is to treat the population with respect. The population, you know what? If I had a my way, you know what I would do? i round them all up on a bus, and I would ship them off into a boat, and they would go way into the Bermuda, and that would be the end of them. I'd put them on an island. Island, and they could eat coconuts and bananas for all I care, but they would not be sitting in, they would not be illegally crossing the street I, and getting in my way you and, and like glaring at me. You and I different mansions. Yeah, and Period. your mansion is going to have homeless people in it and mine's not. But Thank it might, God. It might have homeless people. No, I'm not going back to heaven. I'm going back to where I came from. The fairy realm. Mm. So, you can keep your mansion. I I'm going to go back. Hell. I'm going to go back to. I was actually, <laughs> you set that up. I was actually thinking hell. Oh, you're dumb. But uh, you are from the fairy realm. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to go back home. I'm going to be where I came from. A prince. I know exactly where I came from. That's where I go. That's where I, I go believe back. that. Yeah. You shouldn't do that, Sean. Some homeless people have powers but can't control them. I mean, yeah. I usually just try not to talk to them. Some homeless people could be Jesus. I think that too. I'm nice. When that old lady asked me for a ride home once, I gave her a ride home because I thought that was a test. She never called me again. So she might have Can been I tell you like something? I'm going to tell you guys a story because I give to the homeless constantly because... They just know, like it's a thing on my forehead that says. Idiot. <laughs> that's the one. Easy. Was... <laughs> Gullible. <laughs> Pick a word. Oh, All of them. Oh, and tiny fine bread. And so, they got those very fine. Oh, she's an easy target. Yeah, I I, I feel that. Because you walk too slow. That's why I walk fast. <laughs> if I'm always in a hurry, people don't talk. So I'm going into 7-Eleven and this woman catches Sucker. me. That's Sucker. It's Sucker. there. This woman catches me and she says, do you have any money? And I said, when I come out. Okay. So as I go in, I see another woman, you know, decorating a Frankfurter. Right. And so decorating a Frankfurter. Yeah, because I saw I it and I was like, like huh. The nastiest hot dog I've ever seen. Well, it's okay. It's 7 Eleven. So what? This is, nothing's no, good comes out of the 7 Eleven. When I see people buying the chicken wings, I'm no, like, do you know what that's going to do to the stomach? Death, that's death. <laughs> Literally, like, <laughs> what is wrong with you? Why do you, would you ever look at that and go, mmm, that looks no, tasty? No, I don't even want to eat donuts sometimes. I like, mean, don't I, eat their donuts either. No, it's I mean, no, no, no. I mean, like, at a donut store. Like, if I look and I go, that don't look fresh, I don't even want to eat a donut. Even or a bag. At a, like, at a right, bean. I agree. Seven Eleven is not the place. But in any case, I look over to the side and I see this woman decorating a Frankfurter. And so decorating a Frankfurter, I know that's the funny thing. <laughs> you just decorate, you just put toppings on top. You're just putting it on Like, what is she making a mural? <laughs> like, <laughs> Wait. So I go outside and I see her walking away. And I was so upset. And I'm going, ma'am, ma'am, because I'm I'm always committed. One thing. I'm a committed person. I finished to the end. And so I was like, ma'am, ma'am. And she's not listening to me. And I'm going, oh my God, I can't believe I have to chase after her. Just so, to give her a dollar? Yeah. I a gave dollar. her I gave her more than a dollar. In any case, she's sitting on uh, the bus stop. And I said, I said I would give you money. And she goes, oh, she goes, um, someone gave me a Frankfurter. So I can't eat in front of the store. So I came to sit at... Oh. The, the thing. So and someone so, gave her food. Someone gave her food. Remember, I saw the woman decorated Frankfurt. I could see that she was eating a Frankfurt. So I says, "Well, I, this is you." So I gave her a bill. And then the way she said thank you was just so adorable. And I said, "What's your name?" And she said, "My name is Time." Like the seasoning. No, Time. T I M E. Did, she, did you ask her to spell it? She said... My name is Time, <laughs> like the seasoning. No. T-H-Y-M-E. Time. <laughs> no, she said my name is Time. You're going to make it seem like this is the one that's touched by the, the angel thing. moment, aren't it you? It is! It's a touch by the angel moment! Because I believe in time. If anyone has ever done a reading with me, it's what I say all the time. You have <laughs> you have enough time. I, if they call me and they're like, I'm 30, I'm like, oh my, thank God, you have enough well, time. Well, and you love to also give... Oh, um, Time is your best friend. Okay, I see, yes. But you know what? Hold the phone. Five years. No, I do <laughs> You're get like that. the mistress of time. I am like the mistress of time. And mistress somebody, of time. Somebody said that. Somebody's like, you're really good at time. And I was like, I know because I asked God for it. But she said her name was Time. 
in that Will Smith movie, his very last Will Smith movie. Oh, that terrible one? The black guy the, was... Well, the messages from the universe? Yeah, yeah I like oh, that. The black God. guy in the movie, his name was Time. Oh, man. And Time is oh. one of my best friends. Mm -hmm. So when she said her name was Time, I knew it was a message from God. Speaking of, we're out of it. I gotta go. In any case, I go back to my car and I'm just sitting there when there's a woman also african-american this was the african-american homeless person sitting in her car and i could hear spirit say the, the god of spirit say she gave her the frankfurter so i got out my car and i said excuse me and she did one of these looks like what well with the word the way you just said excuse me that's not a very approachable excuse i me. realize it might have been excuse my, me excuse me that is <laughs> and she gave me a look like what and i was like did you just decorate a frankfurter <laughs> Did you just, Did you just decorate, decorate that frankfurter? a frankfurter for the, for the homeless woman? And she goes, yes. She said, she asked for money. I don't give money. I give food. And so I said to her, can I hug you? Because we were both on the same page. Now, we both would go to the same mansion. With homeless people <laughs> lying out on the, the street corner, on, on the pillars of it, on the steps. Excuse me. <laughs> Gotta get through the door. <laughs> That's what y'all get. I'd probably be decorated up there with frankfurters. Homeless you know people. you should write wiener special and say, hey, you guys should put the decorator. <laughs> a frankfurter is a hot dog, yes. The Germans call it a frankfurter. In New York we call it a oh, frankfurter. Now you, now you want to be cultured. Now she wants to be Miss Culture. We call it a frankfurter in New York. Why don't we you don't just call, call it a we I like calling them what they are really called. A wiener. No, because I wiener a big to us wiener is a mouth. penis. We say wiener because it's a penis. It's a penis to me too. Uh, <laughs> I want an Oscar Mayer wiener. We call Frankfurters, because when we go, oh, oh better okay, yet. But here, but Frankfurters is really like yet. a big one. Those are like the big. No, hotdogs. no. And, 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 and when you get the, the street cart person, we call it Franks. We, we shorten it. It's not even a Frankfurt anymore. It's a Frank. I think we just call them dogs. You, know, you want dogs? <laughs> yeah, no. No, we don't call it hot dogs or Franks. I'm still in Brooklyn, Miss. Ooh! Jazz! Jazz, we call them Franks. No, Jazz. No. Don't you dare lie. What do you Ooh, call them in New York? Cup. I just saw some tea get spilled. You do not call them hot dogs. Ooh. You call them Franks. You are, you're not with me. You're not they with me anymore. They are called Franks, Jazz. Look, don't you dare lie. They're girl. called Franks. You ain't from that hood no more. You can't say we <laughs> nothing. You are Miss Los Angeles now. New Yorkers now. do not call them hot you I are didn't call sitting, here, you are sitting here California. in October with your door open and in a tank top. You are Miss Los Angelian Queen. You are no longer East Coast. <laughs> Mystery dog is what it is. You That's are, true. You are with Alyssa, you are thank you, culture. Alyssa. Alyssa's from New York. She calls them Franks. Stacey, Franks. They're called Franks. Who else says it? Marie, Franks. They're called Franks, Jazz. Monkey meat. Oh, like Jesus, monkey it's meat. just a fucking hot dog. I mean, God is... No, it matters. Executive Diva, what? What happened? Oh, they're talking to each other now. All right, this was a fun show. Yeah. I hope you guys really got long. what you needed out of OJ. Yeah, it's Frank's. Thank you. Hot dogs in Florida. I respect that. I think they're hot dogs in California. I think they're hot dogs they're hot in dogs. Chicago, too. Hot dog in Virginia. Okay. Everybody goes with hot dog. Hot dogs in Jersey? Really? Franks and beans, exactly. That's what we eat. Franks and beans. Do you know what Franks and beans are? Yeah, you get it in a can at the 99 cent store. Okay, just make it. You so specifically you know. probably get it there. I mean, that's... hot dogs in Cali. Because every time I say Frankfurter out here, people are like, "What?" Well, a Frankfurter is like a big German sausage. No, it's not. That's a bratwurst. Bratwurst. If you're gonna be that critical, <laughs> then jazz is staying strong. A hot dogs. Not a bratwurst. <laughs> bratwurst. We say soda in New York, but Chicago says pop. Yeah, Chicago says pop. Mm -hmm. All right, note. guys. Love you all. Cleveland See you says next pop. Week. We'll, see you next week. we'll figure it out. Whatever's pertinent to the time. Please, by next week, we'll have a lot to do on Trump. Trust me. Oh, God. Oh, Another fucking 45 reading. Yeah, we have to. Don't stop complaining. We have to do it until he's out of there. He is. We've done enough. Obama's coming back. We said it. Is he really? Yes. What do you mean? They're bringing him back for some... What? Weird, really? Weird restructuring. How funny. We predicted that. You need to, you need to, you need to post I that. I posted. Wait. Uh -uh, I didn't get to know predicted it. 
I think Kelsey. No, you did not post it. No, I did on Instagram. No, I did not get tagged in it. Usually tag me in it. Oh, okay. Hello. See? I'll tag you in it. Mm -hmm. Kelsey, um, I'll tell Kelsey. Okay. Huh. All right. Obama is I'm pretty Tyler much. I'm Grace. He's, he's, you know, he's, he's you up know, there. Uh, he's, you know, he's pretty high up there. Yes, Tracy did. Thank you. Tyler Remember? So not well. All right, guys. I love you all. This became exhausting at some Tyler point. We covered so many topics not, today. But that's, that's the TV show. Do you get it, Sean? What? What we do. This yeah, is what I know. we do. No, we have a love you too. Made my night. Have a great night. Good night, everyone. Agree. Bye, Tracy. Oh, and bye, Tom. guys. Bye. Thank you for the hearts. Mm. Well, Thank you so you much. Next week. And for I'm those of you who want to see me on side. Wednesday, tune in on YouTube. I'm gonna tune in too. Uh, yeah. Okay. I don't believe you, but that's okay. Well, then, can you text me to remind me? I don't. What time does it come on? Uh, I think I'm gonna stick to 7:30. Okay. I'll I'll try and remember. Three after seven Love you too. Tomorrow. Great night. Oh, thank Bye you. Bye, guys. October horoscopes come in Monday. They'll be out Monday. Good night, Sean and Good night, y'all. We love you. Thank you. We love you guys. Thank you so much. Oh, it's already 10 o'clock. It's 10 o'clock? Mm hmm. How long did we stay on that today? That was like an hour, I think. We did a full hour, I think. Enjoy the show. Thank you, guys. All right, love you all. Will. We gotta this end it sometime. Like Bye.